Hey guys, I'm out at deer camp. I've got a deer tenderloin I'm fixing to cook over the fire. So that's going to be all my ingredients right there. There's the tenderloin off a of deer and then salt and pepper. I probably am going to, that's a little bit thick. I'm going to cut it a little bit so it'll cook a little bit faster. Then I got a fire just smoking over there. I don't know if that was the best way to do it, but I just took my knife and just split it. That way the heat can get in there and the center will get done a little bit quicker. I don't know if it's a good rule of thumb or not, but someone once told me you need to be able to hold your hand there for about three seconds before it gets too hot. Right there's a good spot. Right anywhere in there is a good spot. There we go. Now I'm just going to sit here a while and drink some coffee and watch the meat cook. That wind is blowing ashes up all over the meat. I guess I'll just have to live with that. I just rotated that meat. That way if it's a little harder on that end, maybe it'll cook a little more evenly. That little edge piece right there is going to get done a lot quicker, so I'm going to go ahead and cut it off. Alright, Bradley, grab that piece right there and try it. Give it a rating. Pretty good. 1 to 10, what do you give it? 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. <laughs> Alright. So 8 out of 10, that was a pretty good, honest rating. I think an 8 out of 10 was a good rating pretty good all right I think I'm gonna take it off of there we don't want it to get too done that smoke is killing me Alex recommended we let it sit there and kind of cook a little bit longer it's not on the fire but the middle of it will still tend to cook that'll keep it from getting overcooked I didn't put a lot of meat on there because we had a real big breakfast and um, don't have an appetite for a real big lunch right now. Yeah, we pulled that off at just the right time, I think, or else it would have been overdone. See how that's cooked, I'm afraid. Don't want to drop it, but... Looks pretty good to me. All right, Bradley, you want to get you a piece? Might have should have brought a paper towel, huh? <laughs> if y'all spit it out, we'll know it's not good. No, it's good. It's got good flavor. Yeah. What's What's the score? Eight out of ten. Yeah. Yeah. Eight out of ten. All right, so there you have it, 8 out of 10. Next time we'll go for a 10 out of 10, but 8 out of 10 is pretty good.